More mail. Doing the mail time. Doing the ma doing the mail thing with the boxes and the It's mail time. <laughs> and we have to write down where the mail comes from. So uh, we can write it on the P.O. box fan mail board, the map of the US and beyond. Let's just start with what's on top. That one has a weird sticker. This came from nowhere. How come I don't know where these come from? This one's from Rebecca in Lebanon, Tennessee. Okay. Why am I holding the scissors like that? That looks unsafe. What is this? Oh my, what? Little bow on the front? What the heck? <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you kidding? Tap, tap. Could use it as a weapon. Look at these. So this one says, not your role model. Christine, 2.5 million followers. This one says, someone broke mama's plate. 3 million followers. These are amazing. It's from uh, Make It Special Studio on Etsy. And these are huge mugs. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna make my parents sip out of these and I'm gonna be like, promoting my channel. <laughs> Thank you. This box is really cool too. Look, it like folds out. This one, I must have opened already. Sometimes I open them and then I forget. It's like I open them twice. Double the surprise. This one's from Clarkston, Michigan. I think this one's a painting. Oh, look, a little alloy painting. Thank you so much. How cute. Who is it from? Hello, Christine. I am Madeline. I am from Michigan. I am 14. I just turned 14. Congrats. It is going in the Cactus Art Gallery that I'm going to need to start soon because there's too much cactus everywhere. I'm going to put it all in one spot. Like a museum! <laughs> okay, this little card is from Emmeline in Riverview, Florida. Hello, Christine. My name is Emma. I'm a fairly new TikToker. Just wanted to write you a quick note to tell you that I love your content and I think you're genuinely hilarious. Keep it up. P.S. P.S. I also think cacti make great pets. Me too. Thank you so much for the cute little note. Okay, this feels like clothing. It's gotta be clothing. This is from Warwick, Rhode Island. Whoa, holy cow. Okay. I don't need scissors for this one. What is this? Ooh, this feels like a hearty sweatshirt. Cute. Okay. Oh, look at the back! The, I think the company is Ultimate Pursuit. Okay. Christine, thanks for the many laps. Never stop being you. Enjoy the crew neck. Okay. This one is just oddly heavy. It feels like a board game. How do I not know where it came from? Nothing. Oh, a little scared on this one. Oh, <laughs> faked myself. Ready? Oh! This is... You're kidding. <laughs> You're kidding. Are these, are these what I think these are? Shut up. <laughs> You're kidding. There's scissors for left-handed people because I said how oh, all of the scissors all the scissors in our house are made for right-handed people because everyone in my family is right-handed as far back as our history goes. I'm the only left-handed person. I Now I have one pair, three pairs of huge left-handed scissors. I love this. Thank you so much. What a practical gift. I'm gonna use these all the time. Please tell me there's a note. Oh wait, there's something else. A box cutter? Yo, I love box cutters. I used to work at a grocery store. I don't even own a box cutter. Thank you. <laughs> Who thought I would be so excited over scissors and a box cutter? I used to work at a grocery store and I would break down, I don't know, 30 boxes a day. I loved it. Loved using a box cutter. Who is this from? This person's a genius. Hopefully this will help you with opening boxes from Katie Ricky. Thank you so much. That was a good gift. Okay, this one's from Tracy in Wonder Lake, Illinois. How do I open a box like this? Where do I open this? Do I even need? Let me get my box cutter. What am I doing with these old scissors? Heck yeah. Look at your gifts already coming in handy. Okay, from Tracy. What is this? Sugarbees.com. <laughs> You're joking. You're absolutely joking. Is this a cookie? It's good thing you guys send notes because otherwise I'd be so lost. Hey, Christine, I know everyone has been sending you plates. I'm sending you one that you can eat. Holy cow. She's at sugar underscore bees with a Z on Instagram. I am like beside myself. I mean like the, the detail, but also like you didn't have to do that. Are you kidding? There's even like a little indentation in the middle part of like where. So cool. <laughs> This is why I like opening mail, because it's just, how would I, I would never think that you would send me that. This one's from Veramall, Veramall, Lexington, Kentucky, it's one of those Amazon fulfill centers, okay. 
Oh my, this thing's sharp. That slides right through that. Okay, we got a box and a bag. That's a good sign. Is it a mug? Another cute little cactus mug. Why did I smell it? No one ever let me complain that I don't have mugs. I have so many mugs. Emily Bolt, the green-eyed lady farm. Kankakee, Kankakee, Illinois. That's gotta be close. No, that's like the red button. There's a red button. There's like a red dot record. Nothing's flashing. There's a red button. There's something red flashing. There's a camera and then underneath it's red. Play, trash, look, set, A, F, on. Are you just gonna be in the way? Okay, bye. Oh, this smells good. Right off the bat. Smells good! Okay, cute note. Oh, but I had a weird dream about like a plant company sending me stuff. Did I dream that or was I opening mail in my sleep? Yeah, I sleepwalk. Yeah, well, I open P.O. Box mail in my sleep. Riddle me that. <laughs> Hello, Christine. We have a small family owned lavender farm. The syrup is great in coffee. There's syrup in here? There's syrup in here? There's syrup in here? It's great in coffee, ice cream, French toast, and more. All of that sounds amazing, right? <laughs> That's why it smells so good. You own a lavender farm? Wow. Oh my, they got like lavender in little bags. Oh my god, amazing. Oh, this part's heavy. Lavender syrup? It's not like thick syrup, it's like thin. So cool, thank you. You own your own, you own your own lavender farm? Like, how do you even start that? Yeah, I own a lavender farm. What's up? You want some syrup? <laughs> This one's from Puffs Pendy Melts. Puffs Spendy Melts? From Covina, California. Oh, packing peanuts. Oh my God. I didn't know I was going to the gym today. I, all I see is packing peanuts. Should I just... Oh, what the heck is this? I see a note. Is this a little note? No, this is nothing. <laughs> Look at this little jar that just came out of here. Oh, it's a CBD melt? Okay. This smells so good. 100% natural soy candle company. And they're like sparkly glittery at the top. <laughs> How cool is that? These smell so good. Okay, this one has a weird sticker on the front. Please use for unboxing video. Laughs inside. Oh, it's from Jabberball. I don't know what a Jabberball is. <laughs> I'm also a little scared. I'm gonna let you guys look at it. What the, what is that? Why are my eyes closed? Are these what kids play with nowadays? Jabberball. Not only when you squeeze it does it stick its little tongue out and make a uh, noise, but also the, all this air rushes towards you. <laughs> when you can't go to the club but you miss the music. <laughs> Very weird. Thank you so much. It did make me chuckle. You got me there. Thanks a lot. I gotta open some from the back of the pile. This one's from uh, Jasmine in Portland, Oregon. Did I open this? I only half opened it. What do we got here? How do I, this is a weirdly folded letter. I know you had to fit it in the envelope, but you folded it on all the creases. Hello, my name is Jasmine. She even wrote it out because she knew I couldn't say Jasmine. Now I'm not sure because you wrote it three different ways. <laughs> Anyways, I have got a cactus just like you. My cat tried to eat it and now he has passed. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That took a turn, but I'm so sorry that your cat passed. But um, congrats on the new cactus. Your cat will be in my thoughts. I'm so sorry to hear that, but I'm glad you got the cactus. This one's from A. Justin, Comstock Park, Michigan. And there's a little man on the moon on the stamp. And it says on the back, I didn't lick it because of COVID. Thank you so much. Okay, Christine, you bring me so much joy. Thank you. I love your TikToks. I love your cacti wall. I appreciate your clean humor. <laughs> Thank you. There's a lot more, but what is this? Soothing Tulsi and chamomile. Here you go. I hope you like tea. Oh, it's tea. Also, isn't this stamp super cute? Yes, I didn't I say something about the stamp? The stamp is super cute. This one is from Cheyenne, Rockdale, Texas. Rockdale. What does it look like? It looks like a drawing. Christine, dear Christine, I've seen your TikToks and you are very funny and you make me laugh a lot. You're very hilarious to watch. <laughs> Look, wow, look how creative. We are a great drawer, Cheyenne. Great job. Love it. Down in the heart of Texas. Is that the song? Is that the song? Deep in the heart of Texas. Deep in the heart of Texas. Nailed it. Very nasally. I cannot sing. Where's my record deal? <laughs> this one's from Clara, Medford, Oregon. Hello. Another drawing. Another beautiful drawing. Dear Christine, I'm Clara. I am 
11 years old from Oregon. You are my favorite TikToker and I was wondering if you could shout me out in a video. Let me see what I can do. I draw a picture of you of alloy, but it's not that good. I think it's good. Look at this cute little picture of alloy she drew. And a, a fish. Do you guys see that? Alloy drawing. Alloy. I keep all the letters, just so everyone knows. I keep all the letters. Hannah from Old Fields, West Virginia. Not to be confused with the new fields, the old fields. Remember, you know the old fields of West Virginia? That's where I live. Yeah, but what town? Old Fields. What? Excuse me? Huh? Old Fields. Not the new fields. And for West Virginia. Not the, not Virginia. But West Virginia. Oh, here comes Nosy. Here comes Mr. Nosy. What you need, boy? Okay, postcards. West Virginia is so pretty. Are these the old fields of West Virginia? Take me home. You just sneeze on my postcards? She also drew a cactus. <laughs> it says, sorry. Why are you sorry? My best attempt at drawing a cactus. Sorry. Hello, I'm Hannah. I love watching your videos. Most of the time I'm cooking dinner, washing dishes, chasing my three-year-old son, Jesse, or hiding from him and my husband. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for always having a video to brighten my day and being real and relatable. Thank you so much. The other postcard reminds of the song, Take Me Home Country Roads. Me too. Take me home, country home road. It says, stay safe. So also stay safe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Why is this? This feels like a dictionary and it's heavy. Horomote home, Lexington, Kentucky. I'm gonna let y'all look at it first. Oh, almost cut my knee. Skiddly diddly do. <gasps> Are these bed sheets? Are these bed sheets? Are these bed sheets? Kids duvet cover set. I don't have a kid's bed. Kids home. You know what? It don't matter. I am going. Hold on. This could be like a backdrop. This could be a cover for a table. Tablecloth, backdrop, um, cover my chair. I am so excited, thank you so much. I was trying to look for cactus like themed like covers or like a tapestry. This could be a tapestry, oh my gosh, thank you so much. But, okay, but these, are these pillowcases? Uh, this is a huge pillowcase. Whose pillow is this big? Oh my God! <laughs> Colleen Rogers, Oshkosh. I know Colleen Rogers and Oshkosh. We went to college together. Is this you, girl? We went to class together. We did projects together. We worked on TV shows together. We used to make TV shows um, in college, but no one has sent me stuff from Oshkosh yet, I don't think. So it's going on the board. Come on now. Come on now. Oh, just ripped the whole side of the... Just punched myself in the boob. Happy birthday, Carlene. Oh, did you draw on the outside of that stamp? That's so cute. Carlene, you don't have to send me nothing. Oh. Happy birthday. I miss the days of taping up props last minute and making you taco meat for your show. <laughs> I told y'all we worked on TV shows together. I hope you have a wonderful day. Don't forget to smile, Carlene Rogers. Thank you so much, girl. I love a cylinder box. You know, I just ran out of hand soap. We in the middle of a pandemic, I ran out. Thank you so much for thinking of me. Oh, smells like cotton. Sea cotton island, sea island cotton. I can't read shower gel. Ran out of shower gel too. My leg is literally cramping. My back and my leg are simultaneously, simultaneously cramping. What is this, a big Hershey's kiss? A big old Hershey's, what the heck is this? Is this a gumball? A bath fizzer, I almost ate that. <laughs> what is, oh, why can't I? This is a, it like smelled like sugar cookie, cinnamon, grapes, like a, all the scents. What is this, a magic candle? <laughs> They should make magic candles that change scents. They probably already have that. If not, that's my idea. Don't take it. Me and Carlene are going to make magic candles. <laughs> okay. I know we all want to save the planet, but I love a good notebook. Love a good piece of paper to write on. <laughs> oh, what the? What just fell out of here? Stickers. Then she wrote me a little note. Let me just skim it. Let me see if I can read it fast. Christine, isn't everything extra exciting on your birthday? Birthday breakfast, birthday shower, birthday coffee, birthday laundry, birthday car wash. You know, I'm so proud of you and encouraged by you. I was watching the behind the scenes video of the verified account. One thing that stood out to me is that you said it sounds stupid when you say it out loud. Yet you went through with the idea anyway. Your level of a commitment in these videos is incredible to me. If it were me, I would have stopped after that thought. It sounds stupid out loud. Yo, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> your ability to let go, be silly, and make fun of... Okay, I'm crying. <laughs> Um, yo, we're not supposed to cry during mail time. 
I feel stupid for crying. <laughs> it's okay, I'm gonna keep reading. Your ability to let go, be silly, and make fun of even yourself has always been- Oh my god! <laughs> has always been a- I uh, have to read it again because I keep crying through it. <laughs> your ability to let go, be silly, and make fun of yourself has always been admirable to me. I wish I could be comfortable doing that publicly. <laughs> Girl, I still do it in my room by myself. Wow, okay, you big baby. That's This is the first time I've cried on this channel. Thanks, Carly. <laughs> Anywho, thanks for being who you are. I pray you get discovered. Oh, and I see you on SNL one day. Carlene, girl, thank you so much. This note is everything. But okay, I guess we'll end it on that because um, I'm crying. <laughs> so, we can't go from crying and open up another box. I told y'all I like notes. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just use these um, extra large pillowcases as um, a, a little handkerchief. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> oh! Oh! I just, I just knocked over my... Uh... Oh! This video took all kinds of turns. And I almost died. Because that almost fell on me. <laughs> Deep in the heart of Texas.